Hey everybody, it's April 11th. That makes it a Thursday. You got one more day to go. This is the Roger Williams Media Minute. Today I wanted to talk with you about focus. Focus. We hear a lot about this in terms of productivity all the time. You need to focus, you need to be focused, you need to get focused, you need to find your focus. Uh, what are we talking about when we're saying all this stuff? Now when it comes to a mechanical device like a camera or your eye, you know, focusing is a, the concept is very simple. If you can see clearly, you're in focus. If you can't see clearly, you're out of focus. So uh, in terms of productivity and your mindset and you know, getting things done, being in focus means that you know what you need to accomplish in order to get your bigger goals done. Um, there's a lot of different things you can go about to get to that, such as you know following a certain type of plan like getting things done or Stephen Covey's seven highly effective habits of effective people and Jesus. Or you, know, you can uh, use a tool like OmniFocus or Outlook or Evernote where you can jot down notes and you can check off boxes or, you know, something that I find to be much more effective than all of those things is a simple practice of meditation. Now, in the West, in the U.S. especially, we look at the word meditation and practice of as kind of a weird thing. Um, some see it as a religious situation. Uh, others just see it as foreign and different and therefore strange. Uh, the reality is that meditation is absolutely probably the most simple thing that humans have ever come up with. It is sitting still, breathing, and not thinking. Um, now, as simple as that sounds, actually doing it is very difficult, especially in the modern day and age where you've got your iPhone, you've got your iPad, you got your computer, you got the internet, you got your television. Uh, you know, there's things to do, there's places to drive, there's uh, new restaurants to go and try out. We have endless amounts of things to occupy our minds with now. So being able to find five to 10 minutes in the morning to just sit calmly, breathing, and doing your best to not think is actually probably one of the most challenging things you can, you can try and do nowadays. So what I welcome you to do is Really find you know, a quiet, calm place in your house or in your apartment, wherever you live, where you can spend five to 10 minutes and sit as comfortably as you can. If sitting on the ground is uncomfortable, get a chair. Um, the important thing is that you're sitting up because if you're laying down, there's a chance you'll fall asleep. Now, when you're sitting there, you just wanna work on getting a deep breath going and then you want to start visualizing no thought. Well, what does that mean? What that means is, when you close your eyes right now and you're just trying to breathe deeply, you should notice that there's a number of thoughts going around in your head. You, know, you might be thinking about, hey, what time's my show on tonight? What am I gonna have for dinner? Do I look good in this shirt? Um, what did my boss think about yesterday's meeting? Am I gonna get fired today? What's gonna happen next week? Um, you know, and, and suddenly, and you'll notice on some days you get even stranger thoughts. You start thinking about the things that happened 10, 20 years ago. And, uh, and, and you can start to kind of see the mind just get carried away with itself. So in the practice of meditation, what you're trying to do is push all those things to the periphery, if, if not just completely out of your head for the moment, and instead focus on something that is still and calm. Personally, I like the idea of just white, a soft white light. Um, other people like a body of water. Whatever it takes for you to be able to sit calmly with your eyes closed or mostly closed and just have no thoughts going through your head, I guarantee you will see huge benefits. Now, it is a struggle um, to sit there, so I, I recommend you start five or 10 minutes, slowly work into it, but give it a try. Uh, you know, go do it right now, hit pause, go do it right now, come back, um, or, you know, leave me an email, give me some comments, let me know how it went. Um, you know, I'm trying to do it every single day, 
Uh, I don't have a good discipline, so that doesn't necessarily happen. But when I do uh, sit down and have a meditation practice, those mornings are much more focused, much more productive and clear for me than any others. Uh, so I recommend giving it a try. Tomorrow's Friday, so you should relax anyway. Rock on.